That's a nice crappie, really nice crappie. All right, so it's mid-January and what's happened is we have snow cover now and these crappies, they've slid out of the shallows and they're sitting in the deeper holes of the lake. But what they're doing is at night, they're still coming up to feed in the shallows. I got a good one down here right now. Um, this lake is the typical situation where, there he is, there he is. Oh, oh, got him, got him. Uh, typical situation where the crappies are real stunted. A lot of small crappies, so my solution to that is I fish spoons. A lot of guys, this is a good crappie, a lot of guys aren't fishing spoons for crappies, but they can be deadly, especially when there's a lot of small crappies in the lake and you're looking for some nicer eaters. And this one is way bigger than an eater. That's a nice crappie, really nice crappie. So like I was saying, this uh, jig I have on right now, Lindy Rattle and Flyer, Glow Spoon and Quiver Spoons, great crappie baits, um, especially when you have the situation where you have a ton of small crappies and you're trying to pick out the bigger crappies in the group. This one's way too big to eat. I'm gonna let him go right now. Right to the side of me, six feet of water, and it drops all the way down into 30 some feet here. Uh, it's getting close to dark, 4.30 right now. So what's happening is these bigger crappies, they're cruising around in smaller schools and they're coming up to feed. So I'm using this this spoon, this rattle and flyer spoon, and uh, with the little bit of sound it puts off and the big action it has, these bigger crappies will come in and smack it on their way up to feed in the shallows on that mid lake structure. So what I'm doing is I'm just tipping it with a minnow head, and it, it's a deadly technique. I don't see a lot of guys, you know, the thing these days is tungsten. A lot of guys are using tungsten to fish crappies, and tungsten, it's a great bait. The bug, the toad, stuff like that, great, great crappie bait. But if you're noticing that all your crappies are a little bit too small, what you need to do is try a spoon. Quiver spoon, glow spoon, or rattle and flyer. One of the three, and you'll be surprised how the bigger crappies will come up out of the group of smaller ones, or even if they're owned by themselves, it'll call them in and they'll smash it. 